And then on the other side, you've got the iconic city. I literally almost just dropped my camera in the water. That would have been so bad. Hello and good morning everyone! Kids are waking up early, getting ready for school, woke up extra early, got the kids lunch packed. Turns out last week I forgot to order lunches for the kids. I had to make lunches today. Whoa, what happened to your hair? Crew just barely packed his in his backpack. What did we do today? We did we some did little Hawaiian rolls with turkey and cheese. Super easy. The kids picked out their own chips. I got this awesome box of Pringles so the kids can choose whatever flavor they like. Getting things underway, just going flawlessly. I could not be happier. I've got my clothes on. I'm gonna go for a run after I take the kids to school. Then I'm gonna come home and pick up the house. We unfortunately will not see Brandon until, kids probably won't see Brandon until tomorrow. I'll stay up late tonight. He is about to leave Navio here in just a few short minutes and they have a four and a half hour drive ahead of them. Then they're going to be flying out of Chicago. So hopefully Brandon gets to go enjoy Chicago for just a quick minute today. Everything I'm seeing from Brandon and his siblings looks like they're having a fantastic time. If you guys haven't seen our Instagram at this is how we began. Last night I posted a bunch of pictures and then for whatever reason, emotion overcame me and I just sat in my room and just cried out of gratitude that they're able to go do this trip and have so much fun. All of that goodness is over on our Instagram at this is Howie Bingham. Hello, good morning, and what up? From the middle of America, farm country, USA, we are in Nauvoo, Illinois this morning, starting off the day. We've had an incredible time here with my parents. First of all, if you don't know what's going on, if you haven't seen what we're doing here, if you didn't see the epic surprise, surprise! You've gotta go watch that video, I will link it for you. We showed up, Nauvoo, Illinois, my parents' mission on their last weekend, knocked on the door, they opened the door, <laughs> fell to the ground, literally. <laughs> And then we had the most incredible 48 hours with them. Yesterday, saw some sights, sounds, scenes of what they've been up to and doing here on their mission in Nauvoo. It was an amazing day, culminated by having dinner at their house, just a family dinner, throwback to when we were kids. It has been incredible, you guys. Indescribable, truly. Now, today, to start the day, we're gonna be witnessing what they call the running of the horses, the running of the Clydesdales. They've got huge Clydesdale horses that they have out here that tow carriages around, take people through the town, and once a week, they send them from down there up here, so they're gonna let us stand in the way as they run out. <laughs> Time has come, we're packing up this house, loading into the Tahoe and headed to Chicago, going to Chi-Town today. So we try to put ourselves on the latest flight possible out of Chicago. That way we had a little bit of time to kind of hang out, see some of the sights in Chicago. We're packing up the car, hitting the road, seeing how much time we can get there. It's mom and dad. Honestly, I'm very surprised. There's nothing to brag about except your kids and nobody really believes you when you do brag. But when you show up, They're giving hugs, saying goodbye. It is not goodbye for long, though. Mon and Papa hitting the road on Wednesday to come home. They are leaving this mission in two days' time to come back home to be with us in Utah permanently. In fact, very permanently for Michelle, because they're going to be living with them until they get a new house. Saying goodbye to them here. They're going to be saying goodbye to their mission, so we're going to let them say goodbye to all the friends that they've made here. Give a fond farewell to the place that they've called home for the last year. We, on the other hand, are going to hit the road, head to Chi-Town. Does anybody call it Chi-Town? Thank you, we love you! If you hit anyone, hit Jeff! Thank you, we love you! We have just arrived here in Chicago. It took us a little bit of walking to get out of the parking garage and onto the streets because the streets are layered. So we finally got up to surface level here. We're surrounded by these gorgeous skyscrapers. Just walked over by the Crown Fountains, which was a lot of fun. They've got like animated faces on the fountains, kids playing in them. But now we are at Cloud Gate or the iconic bean as people call it. Check with Sean, make sure that's the actual name people call it so I don't sound stupid. But it is a massive reflective bean. You can see yourself and the city. We're gonna go do some fun pics in here. The idea, where's my family? The idea is to spend a few hours here before we have to get onto our airplane, see some of the sights 
sites here. We wanted to grab some bikes if we could so we can get a few more sites in a limited amount of time before we have to head to the airport because our flight is tonight. Well, there's Sean right there. This is the iconic shot right here though because you've got the cityscape reflecting off of it right here. We're just gonna do a little bit of this today. Walking around, seeing a little bit of Chicago before we head back home. Does that look like the city is in the sky? It is not. It is the reflection off of the giant beam. Where should we go to next? <laughs> We are walking across the Chicago River right now, you guys. There it is behind me. Look how gorgeous this is. And then on the other side, you've got the iconic city. I literally almost just dropped my camera in the water. That would've been so bad. Doing a walk across the river, then we're gonna do the river walk. Sean wants to take us down through there. Look at that, you even got authentic Chicago sirens on cue. Thank you, Chicago PD and FD. <laughs> So we have decided to grab some of these Divi bikes, which has been recently acquired by Lyft. So I just open up the Lyft app, scan the bike, and we're on the go. The good news is we do have four electric bikes here. So because I don't know where I'm gonna put this giant camera, I'm gonna grab an electric. I think Justin's the only one that's taking a pedal bike. We told him that's what he gets for being the strongest. We're gonna unlock these bikes, then we're gonna head to the Navy Pier, and I think that's about all the time we're gonna have before we need to start thinking about heading back to the airport. This is pretty rad, you guys. Rolling down the streets of Chicago on bikes, baby. Let's go, bus behind us. Nobody hit me, here we go. Keep how dope this is. I have got the giant Ferris wheel on the Navy Pier just over my shoulder. We are biking across and out over the pier right now. There are some seriously sick speedboats off to my left. Let's see what I can show you guys right now. Cruising, trying not to get hit by these cars coming up behind me. pedal their way out to the end of the Navy Pier. I'll show you the end of it right here. It's got a bunch of flags on the end of it. And then you've got the cityscape behind us. That skyline is unreal. All of these fun chairs to lay out on and chill on if we had more time. There's a gorgeous lighthouse. Now guys, this is a lake. This looks very much like we're standing at the edge of the ocean. This is a giant lake. You've got a lighthouse right out there, a ton of sailboats, just gorgeous beauty here. It's gonna stand here bask in the skyline, the glorious gorgeousness of the Chicago cityscape behind us. I think after this, we gotta ride the bikes back. Maybe grab some Chicago pizza before we head out of here. I feel like you can't leave without having a little bit of Chicago pizza and we gotta hit the airport. <laughs> What? Oh my God. This is insane, dude. Rolling up now on these insane fountains. Look at this right there. We are riding our bikes around them. We're about to drop Jared off. He's got to go to the airport first. We're doing him dropped off first. Hey, what up? Not before. Get one quick ride around these gorgeous fountains. Look at that. That's incredible. This is Buckingham Fountain right here in Chicago. I got it confused with Bethesda in New York at Central Park, but this is so much bigger. We gotta get Jared to the airport right now, so this is gonna be the last site we really see. I think we're gonna still try and grab a bite of pizza. Pretty iconic way to say goodbye to Chicago. Kids are home from school, have started the after school routine, doing great with reading, homework. In fact, this week they do have a little bit more homework because Friday is their very first ever online day. Our kids have built in twice a quarter, twice a quarter, twice a semester. They are going to have online days where they do schooling online. Their teachers upload all their assignments and they're able to do them the week of that online day. Kids have all of their assignments ready. They're gonna work on them a little bit this week just so we can enjoy Friday and have no school. But then Monday is also Labor Day so we don't have school on Monday either. Pretty exciting. Big things going on this week. Brandon has been sending me tons of pictures and videos of him in Chicago. It looks like they're having an absolute blast. Check out our Instagram at this is how he being him. That's where I've been putting all those pictures. Dad should be boarding his flight soon. Let's see what dad's doing. That is pretty rad. Good. 
could have seen the last probably like 40 minutes. It has been a mad <laughs> dash to get here. The pizza, totally worth it. But oh, so worth it. It put us it a little behind. Delicious. The deep dish takes a long time to cook. It took like 45 minutes to get that pizza it, out. Well, yeah, way longer than we were expecting. Massive traffic backup. We got mm -hmm. super stressed. So we got here as fast as we could, ran through security right to the gate. Not to mention the walk from the restaurant to our car, which was really like a full sprint. And we hit every single green light. <laughs> we crushed it on that walk. Very lucky all the way through, but we are here. The plane is about to board right now. As we got here, we just found out we got a little surprise coming. Both of us have been upgraded to first class today. We are super pumped about it. We're not sitting by each other, so it's not as cool. Yeah, not as fun. But Extra snacks, baby. <laughs> like I get two Biscoff cookies. Let's go. But <laughs> well, we're boarding now, heading home, getting in pretty late tonight. Been an incredible trip. It's Finishing so off fun. in the perfect way. It's just Shell and I, by the way. Mm -hmm. I think it's a video everybody say goodbye. We're Jared left. Month. He went to a different airport. Sean went to a different terminal at this airport, and then Justin's staying here in Chicago. So everybody's gone. Trip's over. Get on the plane. Let's go home. I'm ready. had a super fun afternoon. We went to a hobby store to try and find crew some parts for his car. It's closed. So we ran over and got some dinner at Chick-fil-A. All of that's over on our stories. Should be expecting dad anytime now. He flew from Chicago, had a great day there. I'm just waiting for him to walk in the door. He's home. What are you doing up? I don't know, but it's past my bed. You're waiting for me? I am. <laughs> We're reunited at last. <laughs> Probably a little dig. Oh, I'm He's back. Home. Reunited at last. I still reunited haven't seen the kids. And it feels so good. I have any of that song. That I'd do song? it with you, but I don't know it. It's super old. You so should know. I should know it then if it's old. We just got home, filling me in on tons of details from oh, the trip. We've been standing here downloading for like the last hour about every amazing thing that happens this weekend, guys. If you haven't seen the video. <laughs> Oh, or we surprised yeah. my parents. You've got to go check it out. <laughs> the tear jerker in every regard. They are happy tears of joy, very emotional, very indescribable. We're just so grateful to be able to do that, that everyone had the flexibility in their schedule. They were able, they had the means to get there. The fact that we could do that was such a blessing. That's pretty cool. And to have it go over like it did, worth every amount of effort to get there. It was absolutely incredible. Best family ever. <laughs> and this is how we be. <laughs> Feels amazing to be home though. Cannot yes. wait to see the kids in the morning. We are back to just life tomorrow. I mean, sort of. I think we're going out of town again in two weeks. We are. <laughs> we're gone a lot. Here's something funny. I gave the parking attendant my San Francisco parking ticket. I'm like, this one's already been done. And I was like, how? Like, it has a 20 <laughs> second on it. And I was like, well, what is it now? Oh, that was last week. <laughs> I was here a week ago. It's been a lot. Fun travel, you guys. We've got a little bit more to come. Yeah, we've so. got actually a lot more coming up. Stay tuned. Tomorrow we have a big meeting for the house. Oh my gosh, that's tomorrow. I think that's Brandon why I came back today. That. I completely <laughs> forgot. That is huge. Yeah. It's the biggest one we've had fully engineered and permitted plans we are meeting to find out the cost breakdown of everything wait we don't know how much this house costs yet yeah we don't actually we're gonna <laughs> we find don't. out and if we're cool with it and if we can make it work then we move forward to digging guys so this yes. is a big this meeting this is a tomorrow. big appointment make sure you come back oh <laughs> something wild going on <laughs> love you guys so much we'll see you tomorrow good night everybody bye Bus behind us. Nobody hit me. Here we go.